Hi, I'm Terry Ryan. Welcome to Legacy. I've been in dog training for many, many years, instructing, and I would like to talk to you today about games, using games to train people to train their pet dogs. I have some slides. This is our agenda. We're going to talk about the strategy for training games, especially in class. These games, however, would be fun for parties, uh, any time of, of group gathering. Personal best games will touch on games that you and your dog can do by yourself. Themes for parties, special events. Lateral thinking games, these are designed to help you be more creative with dog training. There are some games that are very good for enrichment. They're for both you and your dog. We'll include a few of those today as well. I'm also going to talk a little bit about games that I think are especially good for dogs and kids. Our next station is called the Olympic Symbol Game. Once again, we're taking all those little basics that you've worked so hard on and we're putting them together into a more complex behavior. This is training. It's not a test. It's not a win or lose. We don't care what the other guys in your class do. We're working with you and your dog. Let me go over it for, with you for just a second. We have a starting line. Your dog is going to start here. I don't care if she's sitting or standing. You're going to loose leash walk over to the first ring. Try and get her into the ring. I don't care if she's exactly in the ring or not. This is just kind of a marker, place marker. Um, I want you for this first station, the blue ring, to simply praise your dog. I want you to praise your dog for three seconds. So I'm going to count off one banana, two banana, three banana. When that's done, I'm going to direct you to the next ring. That's going to be the purple one over here. You don't have to remember this. I'm going to be telling it to you as we go along. Over here, we're going to get a sit. So let's get into the ring. The dog is going to sit. I'm going to count one banana, two banana, three banana, and then you're going to cue her or give her a release and cue her to come over to the next ring, the orange ring. Over here, we're going to do a down. Now, some dogs are longer than others, so your dog might overlap. I'm not concerned. I'm concerned that your dog is willing to go down happily and that she stay down for, for three seconds. I'm going to call the end of that exercise, you're going to release your dog or cure to come on over here to the next circle. And in this green circle, we're going to, I'll call out body parts. And you touch the various body parts, make sure your dog is happy. I'm looking to be sure your dog is okay with handling. When we're done with that, I'm going to direct you over here to the multicolor ring. You're going to do a sit again, only this time you're going to uh, leave your dog. You're going to tell her stay. I'm going to come right over to the line. And then you're going to call her. Use her name first. Use your cue for come. And the most important part of this exercise is she come up happily and she receive three seconds of focused attention. It's you and her together. No drive-bys. That's up to you. Don't let your dog down. Okay? I'm going to call Daniel and Holly over to do a couple of example stations. Daniel, let's go up and down the steps, loose leash. Okay, let's go, girl. Come on. Yay, good girl. Very good girl. nice. Yes. Turn come around on. and come on back. Come on, Gary. Yay, let's go. Good yes, for her. Good girl. Okay, next station, okay. sitter. Have her sit. sit. Tell her she's a good girl. Good girl. Okay, next station, Daniel. You ready for the door? Yep. Stay. Hi, come on. Good, Good girl. girl. That's nice. Good for you. Okay, let's go on over to the office now. I'm going to help Daniel come up with some more ideas for his personal best walkabout in his own home. So Daniel, pretend you need to get up and rummage around the closet for something. Dogs are curious. If you walk somewhere and look like there's something interesting, they're going to want to come over. It might not be safe. It might not be convenient. So get your dog into a down and have her wait while you're finding your stuff. Okay. Come on, Gilly. Right here. Good 
Good girl, yeah. Kiss it. Down. <laughs> Key down. Good girl, stay. Good girl, let's stay. Have a good time playing games with your people and their dogs.